Hey guys, my name is Nikki. I want to welcome you to Carrie Grace. All right, so today I'm going to be sharing with you a cook and clean with me. All right, so tonight is Mexican night at our house. It's Taco Tuesday. We're actually having burritos. So I just thought I'd vlog and take you guys along with me while I cook and clean. All right, so first up, I have got a pound of ground beef. I'm about to cook that. And then I'm going to make this Spanish rice. I'm going to do this one in the microwave. Then I'm also going to make this cilantro lime rice and this one I need to make in the pan so that's what I'm getting ready to do I know I've talked about this can opener in a favorites video, but you guys, this can opener is seriously one of my favorite things. I do have it linked down in my Amazon shop just in case you want to check it out, but it is one of the clean edge can openers and it does all kinds of different things. So I drained my meat and I'm about to load it up with some seasoning. I'm going to use black pepper, going to use a little bit of this, a little bit of this, a tiny bit of oregano, a good bit of salt, some onion powder, garlic salt, and chili powder. I do not measure any of this. I just start dumping it in. always make a giant mess when I'm cooking every night but one thing that I do try to do is I try to clean up as I go so that it's not such a big mess at the very end when I'm all done. I've got to know, do you buy pre-shredded cheese or do you shred your own cheese? I used to always buy pre-shredded cheese, but then I learned that shredded cheese has some kind of like film on it that keeps it from sticking together. And it also keeps it from melting real evenly. So I started buying block cheese and just shredding it myself. And I found that it actually tastes better and it melts easier. So there's just a tip. Thank you. 
All right, so we're about to assemble our burritos. I've got a choice of cilantro, lime rice, Spanish rice, got ground beef here, got chili beans here, got plenty of cheese. We're gonna heat up this cheese dip. I'm gonna heat up these tortillas real quick and then I'm just gonna get the sour cream and salsa and we're gonna eat dinner. Now it's time to get these leftovers and all this food put away. I don't know how it works at your house, but at our house on leftover night, when there is Mexican leftovers, everybody in our house wants them for dinner that night. Okay, so please tell me I'm not the only one that has to rearrange the dishes in the top rack and sometimes the bottom rack after my kids and the rest of my family has been putting things in there all day. I know I'm not alone. We always start our dishwasher before we go to bed, but we do the delayed start. That way it'll run like around midnight or two o'clock in the morning so that we don't have to listen to the dishwasher like while we're watching TV or while we're trying to go to sleep.
All right, so now it's time for my favorite part of cleaning up the kitchen each night, wiping down the counters. Tonight, I'm gonna be using my e-cloth. The thing that I like about the e-cloth is all you need is water. It does a really great job of cleaning everything up. This one is actually the stainless one. I just get it wet, it's still nice and soft, and it does a really good job on my granite counters. Some nights, I opt to use just a regular dishcloth with a homemade granite cleaner. It just kind of depends on what I feel like it needs that night. It is time to wrap this video up because my kitchen is now finally almost clean. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me while I cooked and cleaned tonight. If you enjoy these kind of videos, please give this video a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel and not already subscribed, please consider subscribing. I do post new videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday.